Under module 5, we will be covering the power screw. It has the mechanics of power screw, stresses in power screws, efficiency and self-locking, and uh, finally design of power screws. So, so this we will be covering in this video. So we will be seeing what power screws are. So it is a device used to convert a rotary motion into slow translatory motion and for transmitting the Power. So, what are the applications? So, to raise the load, we have uh, seen the screw jack which is used to, you know, lift the vehicle and to replace the tires. And the second application is to obtain the accurate motion in machining operations. You have seen it in the lead screw of the lathe, right? We have worked with the lathe, so you know what is lead screw, how it rotates. Third is to clamp the workpiece example uh, that we have seen with the vices we have worked with the vice to exert force on the work so pressing devices we use the power screws to load the specimen so you have seen this in the universal testing machines right so uh, this is also a type of power screw to regulate the fluid flow that is in the walls so these are the some of the applications uh, that power screws are used this is one of the figure shows the, the screw jack which is used to lift the load especially in the automobiles and we have one uh, uh, screw of the vise which is used to tighten the work pieces. What are the advantages of the power screws? Large loading capacity in a compact space is simple in design and easy to manufacture smooth and noiseless operation large mechanical advantage or you can multiple the efforts that you have applied high accuracy of motion so these are some of the applications uh, that we find in power screw coming to the drawback or demerits or a disadvantage of the power screws poor efficiency due to frictional losses uh, as as low as 50 40 percent efficiency uh, therefore, it is not used in continuous power transmission in machine tools with the exception of the lead screw. Except the lead screw in the lathe, uh, all other power continuous power transmission, we don't go for the power screw. And high friction in thread causes rapid wear of the screw or the nut. Coming to the types of power screws under the applications, so the application where high efficiency is desired example a lead screw and presses application where low efficiency is desired example screw jacks and clamps and vices and the threads used for fastening purpose such as the V threads are not suitable for the power screws so these are the some of the types that are two major type high efficiency and low efficiency 